Tonight, police say a 15-year-old disabled girl was raped at a hotel that houses migrants in Rockland. The man accused of attacking the girl is a migrant staying, who's staying at that shelter. WBZ's Brandon Truitt is live in Rockland with the swift reaction tonight from the community. So troubling, Brandon. Yeah, Lisa and David, authorities have confirmed to us that both the victim and the suspect were living in this hotel. Police say that it was ultimately the person working the front desk who called them to report a disabled 15-year-old girl had been sexually assaulted. I want to give you a look at 26-year-old Corey Alvarez. He was charged with child rape today in Hingham District Court. His defense attorney said that he came here from Haiti as part of the migrant system. Now, last night, police say they were called to this comfort inn off Hingham Street just after 7. When they got here, they said they found the 15-year-old victim in the lobby. They had to use translators, and through that, the girl was able to tell police that Alvarez raped her in his room while she was getting help with an app on her tablet. Police say the victim reported telling Alvarez to leave her alone, but that he didn't stop. That girl was taken to the hospital. Alvarez was arrested here last night. And new here at 6 o'clock, we have word from State Representative David DeCoste. He's the Republican that serves this district. He says, I am absolutely appalled by the incident that took place in Rockland. Above all, my heartfelt sympathies extend to the young girl who has reportedly been subjected to abuse. The Commonwealth has failed this young girl. We have reached out to the governor's office for this report. So far, we have not heard back. Alvarez, for his part, is being held without bond. He has another court date next week. Live in Rockland, Brandon Truitt, WBZ News. Brandon